In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to adjust the cable tension on the tilt actuator of a focus. So when we're adjusting the actuator cable on the, on the manual tilt, the first thing that I'd like to uh, talk about is the fact that you can utilize either the hand pull trigger or the foot release. It will utilize the same type of mechanism to communicate between the, the controlling device and the tilt mechanism. When the item comes out of the factory, it may be a little bit loose and you're going to notice that there is a means to adjust the tension and a jam nut on top of here. So what we want to do is actually see how much we have to pull it to, to activate the release. So I think this is a little loose. So what we're going to do is back this out to apply a little more tension so that it releases earlier. There we go, and much smoother. So there's less slop in the system. Now once we get it to where there's less slop, we're going to run this nut, the jam nut, down to the bottom and this is a 10 millimeter nut on the bottom and top. So the long nut, I'll use my small crescent wrench to hold it and my 10 millimeter open end to actually do the top and then like the, the turnbuckle on the back of the Q6 Edge, we're going to tighten that down. We're not going to put 20 foot-pounds on this, of course, because it's much smaller. However, we want to make it tight enough so that it won't back itself off over time. On this particular unit, it also has a recline mechanism with a cable release, just like the tilt cable release. Likewise, from the factory, it will not be adjusted and will require field adjustment. So what we're going to do is run that back off until we get it to where it releases easily. And then we're going to run that jam nut down on top of it. Again, going to use the crescent wrench to hold it and use the 10 millimeter wrench to tighten the jam nut on top. It is very important that this is done on both sides. And that it is tightened sufficiently to not allow the bolt to back off over time. This will say multiple callbacks and courtesy calls within the first six months and may even stymie calls later in the life of the equipment.